What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another stock video. I'm going to be giving an update to Apple. Let's get into it. All right guys, so last time's bearish prediction pretty much came true and now we're sitting at the 170 area. Also, we've been pretty bearish ever since we made this double top and the cancellation of the EV project. Hopefully things turn around for Apple and from here, I'm going to give my predictions on what I think can happen next. Starting out with the most bullish prediction, and that would be for us to come back up and retest that 174 resistance. If we can break out, we'll come back up right here to the bottom of the gap. If we can break out of that as well, we'll fill the gap and continue up, and I think we'll get back to 180. That would be the most bullish thing that Apple could do in the coming weeks. Moving on, guys, to the second scenario. It's bearish in the beginning, and then it turns bullish, but that would be for us to come all the way back down and retest. It looks like... 168 ish and if we can't find support there we could even come all the way back down to 165 but then we'll get a nice bounce and we'll pretty much make a giant w so it could either happen down there or right here but i think that could definitely play out for apple moving on guys to the bearish scenario and that would be for us to either sideways trade up here or to retest the resistance one more time and then get rejected and then we'll come back down to these levels if we can't find support here we can get pushed back down to 165 and from here if we can't find support we could get pushed back down to 160 to high 150s so all the way back down here this would be worst case scenario in the coming weeks for apple that's all i have for you guys thank you guys for watching and until next time